This is a quick overview of the Chromium web browser on the new Raspbian operating system for Raspberry Pi. I am running Raspbian currently on a Raspberry Pi 3 and this is Raspbian with Pixel which is the recent update to the desktop environment for Raspberry Pis using the Raspbian operating system. Pixel is an acronym for Pi Improved X Window Environment Lightweight. But what you can see, it really is. It's just a you know crisp new interface with great new features uh, for Raspberry Pi. One of the biggest of which is the addition of Chromium as the new default web browser replacing Epiphany. So let's open the web browser and take a look at Chromium. As you can see right off the bat, Chromium is very similar to Google Chrome. And that's really no surprise because Chromium is the open source web browser project from which Google Chrome draws its source code. One of the default add-ons is H.264i5. H.264i5 is uh, designed to help YouTube run better on the Raspberry Pi. So there are some options you can utilize, including enabling or disabling it or blocking 60 frame per second video. An additional included add-on is uBlock. uBlock's a leaner alternative essentially of you know, the more memory hungry AdBlock Plus add-on for Chrome. It, you can turn it on and off. You can enable some other alternatives, including blocking all pop-ups for a site or uh, blocking large media elements for the site to help Raspberry Pi again work more smoothly. So let's try a search. I'm going to type in Raspberry Pi. And you'll see that the default search engine is DuckDuckGo. DuckDuckGo is a search engine that's designed to protect its user privacy because it doesn't profile you. It doesn't collect any personal information about you or your web searches, and therefore it has nothing it can lose. It also claims to emphasize getting information from the best source rather than from the most sources like some alternative search engines. So we click on Raspberry Pi. We can go to the official raspberrypi.org website and you can see the many resources that raspberrypi.org provides for Raspberry Pi users. By the way, if you'd like to change your default internet browser, you can go up to the three little dots here, which is the settings screen, click it, and it gives you a number of options, including the ability to delete your histories, um, go incognito when you do your searches, and then if you go down to settings, it'll give you some uh, settings that are familiar if you use Chrome browser, including the ability to change your default search engine. Here we have DuckDuckGo, but you can change it to others like Google, Yahoo, or Bing. Finally, if you would like to have all of your bookmarks and passwords from Google and other settings on this device, you can go up to the top here. There's a little person icon. Click it, and it'll give you the ability to sign in to Chromium um, and you just use your Google account information including your email and your password. And that's it for our quick overview of Chromium web browser on Raspbian for Raspberry Pi.